Hey everybody, my name is Mark Pena. I'm a meteorologist in Washington, D.C., tracking the cherry blossoms for you this year. And we've reached stage two now, and that's two of five stages before peak bloom, which means the florets are visible. But to put that in perspective with last year, last year we reached peak bloom on March 17th. So things are going a little slower this year. So let's talk a little bit about why that's the case and what to expect as we head towards peak bloom 2025. Now, as I mentioned, last year we reached peak bloom on March 17th. That was almost two weeks before the average peak bloom, which is April 2nd. And this year, the forecast peak bloom is about March 28th. So it's still a little early, but nowhere near as early as last year. So again, what's causing this? So one of the main reasons is temperatures. And we had a pretty average winter. It just felt so much colder because we've had so many consecutive warmer than average winters leading up to this year that it felt so much colder. But whenever you look back, last winter was the seventh warmest on record. So it makes sense that our cherry blossoms and all of our trees and flowers would bloom a lot earlier. And so with this winter, it was pretty close to average. And whenever you look at the numbers, everything's gonna line up pretty close to average. And so that's gonna yield a pretty average peak bloom with not only our cherry blossoms but our trees flowers and everything else that blooms in the springtime all right so what's next for the rest of the season well the next stage is stage three which is extension of florets and if we get some warmer afternoons which is looking likely that'll likely speed along the process so we're likely going to reach stage three in the next several days by the middle part of the week because we've got 60s and 70s in the forecast but as we head towards friday a cold front arrives and what that cold front will do is knock temperatures down for Friday and bring us close to freezing at night. So that might prolong heading into stage four. And at that point, we're March 21st, March 22nd. So that'll likely get us close to our prediction of March 28th for peak bloom. All right, that's it for your stage two update. So stay tuned as we head towards stage three.